Quatan jungle. With at least two divisions of Tarkatans. They're on the move constantly to avoid detection. That's not far. Maybe 200 kilometers. You know what to do. Yes, ma'am. Good luck. Blade out. You have new information? From Earthrealm? Kano talked. Gave us the details on Melina's location. She has the amulet, but she's got a lot of protection. We will strike immediately. Perhaps a two-pronged approach. The army will engage Melina, distract her, while this one retrieves the amulet. Not alone. This one's coming with. Still is of the essence. Did you not hear me? You may assist in the main strike. Cora, we will grant their request, and I will finally be rid of Melina. This one understands your logic, but does not reach the same conclusion. Like others, this one is not pleased with Melina as Connor, but it is not clear your crew will succeed. That is why I invited our Zaterran friend. Listen, and join us. I know things about Melina. Her troubled rule will fall in the telling, and pave the way for Quatal. What would you know that... Ah, there they are. Three of your fellow counselors, whispering like handmaidens. About what, I wonder? If only you would hear our counsel, as war with Netherrealm looms. I have urged detente with Earthrealm. And I've told you I would sooner die than treat with my father's murderers! You refuse practical solutions to credible threats. You endanger the realm. And sedition does not? Speak your last before I have your tongue. You are not Shao Kahn's true heir. She is a construct formed in Shang Tsung's flesh pits. I saw this. Your best claim to the throne is moot. How dare you! I succeed Shao Kahn by his decree! Succeed him you have, but Outworld demands new leadership. From you, Arshtek fool. Kill him! <laughs> this one serves Nelina no longer! <laughs> ah! You will defend your Empress! Our creator Shao Kahn is dead. We will serve whom we choose. <laughs> Your last ally has left you. Take her away. We would serve the new ruler of Outworld. Then you serve Kotal Khan.
there. Here to surrender, traitor? You speak of treason. This one knows you desire the throne. Why serve Melina? I advise her. Stealing the amulet was my genius. It kills her a bit each time she uses it. As both sides diminish, you fill the void. Exactly my plan. <laughs> 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 end here. Leaving without your friend, Devora? Your people believe we avoided your island out of respect for your solitary nature. We just didn't like you. The Kaitin do prefer solitude, which I will achieve momentarily. <laughs> Now two Edenians will die. I know you said you weren't friends, but you're not killing them. Head's fine, by the way. Very well. Let us go. Step aside. That is really disturbing. Devora! This one knew you would not stray far from the amulet. You took my throne. Now you wish to steal my means of reclaiming it? Neither was meant for you. Who are you to say? I will take something of yours. Your life! Enjoy your death. Enough of your prattle. Finish me, that I may join my father. You do not deserve death by an emperor's hand. Instead, I give the honor to my worthy first minister. Rebellion is over. Well, thanks for that. I know I'll never eat again. With your leave, we're gonna head back to Earthrealm. Put the amulet back where it belongs. <gasps> the hell are you doing? Earthrealm cannot be trusted to protect the amulet. It will remain with me. Reiko Accords require the that accords you- Accords no longer concern me. But you may prove useful when Raiden comes for this. This one deceived them. 
The amulet is in Kotopan's possession. You can retrieve it. He trusts no one else to transport it. Keeping you close to the Outworld throne these many years has proven most fortuitous, Devora. They never suspected one of their own to be a disciple of our lord. This one lives to serve Shilok. You have done well. Now bring it to me. Without delay, Anchi. Be freed. We make for my fortress. Is there a problem? Two problems. 